throughout your career, Alex, where have you seen the strongest will to innovate and use new tech in the exchange and trading business from the 1970s until now? Where specifically? I can't be specific. I think the key element that's always been the driver is profit. If we weren't capitalists, we wouldn't do half of the things that we'd achieved. What I think has happened is the technologists have moved so close to the business people and the business people so close to the technologists that this cross flow of information and ideas is better now than ever before. And technology has obviously enabled that to be even better. I sit here in Ohio and I work with my colleagues in Sweden and we share ideas and we talk about stuff both on the phone, on, in a video call like this or electronically through other tools. And I think that is one of the biggest developments. This move from, I need a system, it's got to fit this spec to, I know I have to have certain tools in place. How can I make them more useful to me? And how can I make them help me make money? So my view on risk is, risk is what we take to make money, but we need to understand every little piece of it. And I also think we're going to start seeing the move towards risk and behavioral monitoring coalescing. In other words, if the trader's having a bad day and losing money pops up in the risk platform, now you're going to be keeping an eye on him in the surveillance and market behavior platform because it's quite likely he's going to do something stupid and vice versa. Somebody doing something stupid presents you with massive risk. And I think we will see this this blending of middle office, front office uh, monitoring more and more where one, shall we say, data source delivers all kinds of value through different user applications.